The Independent National Electoral Commission, INEC, says it will not tolerate any act of violence during the September 19th Edo State Governorship election. INEC's National Commissioner, Festus Okoye, made this known during a one-day workshop for journalists in Edo State, saying residents of the state must be allowed to exercise their franchise in a peaceful and conducive atmosphere. Okoye said the commission has given a marching order to security agencies to apprehend, arrest and sanction persons found to be trying to sabotage the process on election day. The commission will not tolerate violence or violent conduct of any manner in terms of the rallies of political parties and their campaigns and also in terms of what happens on election day. The people must be allowed to go to the polling units to go and vote without being molested and without any form of violence being unleashed, unleashed on them. And we are already uh, in consultative uh, uh, process with the security agencies on how to degrade to the barest minimum acts of violence that have the capacity to treat in the conduct of the Do and Undo governorship elections. We are not going to tolerate any acts of violence and we are not going to also condone acts of violence. We, are go we have told the security people any individual that t attempts to jeopardize the electoral process uh, should be pulled in, investigated, and if found culpable, uh, if, uh, if found to have committed a, 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 if there is a prima facie case against the person, the person should be charged to court. We have uh, in our policy document is clear on how we are going to have two queues, outer and a queue inside, and. Uh, we we'll have the social. We are going to observe the social distance in terms of voters. Uh, six feet, two meters. Everybody must wear face masks. Both the electoral officer, officials and the voters.